everyone welcome back to my channel so in today's video we are doing a ipsy glam bag unbagging and I just kind of feel like this is getting later and later I know I've skipped a couple times on filming it because I just feel like it's too late but you know what I figured this time better late than never right um, now I actually also just received my boxycharm base box no sorry boxycharm Lux, and um that was super late as well considering it's almost the end of the month but we're gonna go ahead and box that a little bit later anyway uh so yeah let's jump right in so for the month of what month are we in september <laughs> Uh, the first thing I noticed, it's actually outside of the little bag. Uh, this was a choice item for me. This is from Derma E. It's the Advanced Peptides and Collagen Serum. I've actually used their brand before. There is a uh, like a scar gel that they have that I have been using on my acne scars. Um, I really had some really bad ones right here and I've been using it every night. Um, it's supposed to use it like every morning and every night so it does take a little bit longer but it has really relieved some of my scars and I am just over the moon with it. Um, so I'm actually really excited to try another product from them considering the first one that I bought works so well. Um, so I do highly suggest that if you have any scarring, it does take a little while. It's, you're not going to see results overnight, um, but definitely check that out. Uh, I will have a link for it down below. So super excited to try this. It says uh, that this is cruelty free, gluten free, uh, soy free, 100% vegan and GMO free. Take a stand against wrinkles. This nourishing double action powerhouse serum is formulated with multi-peptides, uh, to help reduce the appearance of deep lines and wrinkles while plant extract, I'm not even going to say the name because I can't pronounce it, a powerful antioxidant may help support healthy collagen. So this already makes my bag really good. So for the month of September, I actually kind of dig the colors that they went with. So you have like this burgundy uh, color on one side and then you have the yellow on the other side. So it kind of reminds me of like, you know, uh, changing leaves. So that's really nice. And yeah, let's see what else we got in here. So the first item I see is the Pore Professionals Hydrating Primer. I've actually tried this before. Um, it didn't really work for me. I do like the original, but it is a nice little sample size. I'm going to go ahead and put this aside for my Christmas giveaway. The next item we have is from or Oriza Beauty. I've received eyeshadows them from them before. They look really, really pretty. It's just the ones that they send me. It's kind of like colors I have in all my other palettes because I do have a big collection. So uh, I don't really keep it. So I don't know if you'll be able to see it. This is a camo shimmer palette and looks like there's a green in there but that's actually uh definitely really pretty can you see that there you go so it looks like a green and a gold and a uh, like a brown and a mauve color so definitely like a fall palette that's really nice but i do have colors like this so once again i'm going to go ahead and set this aside to go in my christmas giveaway all right what else do we have in here let's see Ooh, okay I like this <laughs> uh, I actually really like enjoy Tarte Tarte has some of my favorite products um, so this is the Tarte Big Ego uh, mascara I don't believe I have tried this before so I'm super excited to test this out I actually do have Tarte's uh, man eater mascara on today and um, yeah super excited for this one and the last item we have is from Mayo, Mayo. It's their Clearly Brilliant Tinted Lip. I'm not really a lip, a lip pencil kind of girl, especially with my my top lip being crooked from my bike accident. Uh, it just doesn't do well. So I'm gonna go ahead and pass this along as well. But uh, I still think it's a decent bag. There are decent products in here. Um, so I'm not completely, so I'm not disappointed. So we got the Derma E and the Tarte Ego that I love and that I am keeping. We got the Professional Primer, which is, it's still a good primer. It's just, I have a, a lot more pores than this would cover. Uh, the eyeshadow palette, which is geared to fall. So they're really, really pretty colors. And then the lip, uh, the lip balm, which it's a pretty shade. It's just, uh, I can't use this on my lips. So yeah. That is it for the month of September. I still think it was pretty nice, especially for only what, like $12? 
I'm, I'm really happy with it. So can't wait to see what they give me next month. Now I'm really excited to see what is in my BoxyCharm Lux since they were so late getting it here. <sighs> Feels like, I don't know. <gasps> Ooh, <laughs> okay. I'm already excited. Now this, you guys. Ah, okay. So the first item I have is the Pharmacy Cheer Up Brightening Vitamin C Eye Cream. I love Pharmacy as a brand. They have some really good products. Um, so super excited to have this and test this out. I've gotten to where, oh my nail just broke. I've gotten to where I, um, I leave like my skincare in the bathroom rather than in my beauty station because that way I can use it a little bit more. It's easier just to do once I get out of the shower for the night. But this is what it looks like. Love it. I want to know what it smells like. I don't really smell cherry. No, I really... I don't smell cherry. I don't smell anything. No, nope, don't smell anything. It's got like a little red tint to it, so that's cute, but... There really isn't a smell. I was expecting a little bit more of a cherry smell, but I'll still give it a test out and see how that works out for me. Now we do have a product in here from Fenty Beauty. Yes, very excited for this. This is the Kilowatt Foil Freestyle, Freestyle Highlighter Duo. So I have, what, two of her highlighters and I love them. Now these are a little bit more of the exotic colors, should, you, should I say? But they're still colors that I would use. So I got Sandcastle and Minted Mojito, which is like a blue. So it's like a champagne kind of in a blue. Those are really, really, really pretty, you guys. Yes. So let's go ahead and give these bad boys a swatch. Oh, yeah. And that blue is going to come in handy with some looks I have uh, in the, in the wintertime. So, oh, that's so pretty. Look. It's so pretty. Hmm. <laughs> Highlighters make me happy. <laughs> All right, so super excited that this is in here, you guys. Like that, that's awesome. Okay, moving on, we have the Ahava Dead Sea Water Mineral Hand Cream. I've actually tested this brand out several times from my FabFitFun. I do enjoy it, but I still have like a whole bottle, so I'm gonna go ahead and put this in my Christmas giveaway as well. Uh, what is this? Oh, this is from Milk Makeup. Now, I don't have too many things from Milk Makeup. Maybe I've tested out like one or two items. Uh, it w I did have a, like a blush that I just received not too long ago, but my dog got to it, so yeah, that was fun. <laughs> uh, this is the Matcha Purifying Face Mask. Solid clay mask stick, cleanses pores, controls oils, and calms redness for a fresh complexion. That's actually right up my alley because I do have a lot of pores. I have a lot of redness in my cheeks, so that's going to be interesting. Um, hmm. All right, so that is definitely unique. It's like a green mask, so I'm assuming you just roll it on and then wash it off. Um, I do finally want to read the instructions and see how that works, but this one actually makes me excited. Not too many things make me excited from Milk Makeup, but this one definitely does because it's something different. Okay, it says apply mask evenly to damp or dry skin. Uh, let dry for five to ten minutes, then rinse with warm water. Use two to three times a week. Uh, tips, spot treat areas that need purifying and balancing, cruelty free, paraben free, vegan, silicone free, and gluten free. So yeah, that is totally different. I'm really excited for this and that'll be fun. All right, another item we have. Whoa, I have heard this brand is so freaking expensive. And when I say expensive, I'm not thinking like Marc Jacobs expensive. I'm thinking like Dior and Chanel and all that other, you know, high-end crap because this is way up there with that. So this is their 111 Skin Face Mask, um, the Rose Gold Brightening Facial Treatment Mask. Diminishes the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles. It better. <laughs> uh, 24 gold, karat gold enhances skin radiance to brighten an even skin tone. Rejuvenates and nourishes 
lackluster skin reinforces and protects skin barrier function so we shall see now there are five masks in here i cannot wait to see what the price of that is because I, I already know it is crazy expensive and the next item we have yay it's from pure cosmetics i actually enjoy pure cosmetics and uh this is a brush set looks comes with a cute little case holder love it and let's see we're gonna pop this open oh look in there your brushes good for traveling um looks like we got some nice eye brushes some nice face brushes i love the pink candles on them oh i love this right here uh that it comes with like a little eye brush comb and an eyelash comb so super excited this is in here i love makeup brushes i feel like i can never get enough so this makes me super happy okay so the last thing we have in here is from hip dot i've actually heard some really good things about this brand uh, I guess this is their Zion palette. It's really pretty packaging. Uh, pressed pigment palette. Just one look at Utah's sandstone caves will transport you to a world of majestic beauty. Connect with these sweeping canyons through the dramatic reds, deep oranges, and rich purples of Zion. Okay. That's pretty cool. So the Utah sandstone caves were their inspiration. That's actually, that makes sense. Um... With the design so this is cruelty free vegan paraben free talc free mineral oil free um pathate free <laughs> uh and i do like the fact that their packaging is pretty much the same on the inside okay so let's open this up Ooh, that is really pretty this is actually right up my alley because i love pinks i love purples I definitely am a warm tone kind of girl too. So this has all the right shades in there. Look at that. Very, very, very pretty. And actually, I've been looking through my collection for like the perfect, almost like a cranberry shade. And I, I, I can't believe I have not found the shade that I'm looking for because I have this idea of this makeup look that I want to do. It's like this smoky cranberry look with this deep purple lip. Oh, it's, I, I have it in my head. I just haven't found the right shade for it. So let's give this one a swatch because I want to see if this one will work. And it's a little dry to the touch, but you know, that doesn't mean anything. And then we're going to do, let's do this light purple. I want to see how that swatches. And of course we need a shimmer. So I'm going to go with the light shimmer up here. Now let's go with this Canyon Orangey Peach shade. That one's a little bit more smooth, definitely crumbling. Uh, you won't be able to see it. Um, crumbling in the pan. Actually, let me see. Can you see it right there? Yeah, crumbling in the pan as I swatch, which is not a big deal. But these are your shades. Very, very pretty. Put these right next to the highlighter. Ooh. That might be the shade that I need to create the look I am thinking about. And we got a light purple. That's really pretty. Oh, that's really pretty. Ooh, that's really pretty too. So there are the swatches. Oh yeah, very, very happy. I can't wait to actually do a eye look with this and test it out and see how it performs on the eyes. Let's see how much this bad boy box is worth. So we got the pharmacy eye cream for $45. That seems about right. The hip dot palette is $30. Uh, the persona cosmetics, um, one lip gloss. Where'd that go? Oh, my bad. We have one more item. <laughs> All right. So this is persona cosmetics, uh, lip gloss in the shade honey gloss. And I probably won't keep this because I'm very particular about my glosses, but it's a pretty shade. So I'm going to go ahead and pass this on as well. So, sorry guys, didn't realize there was one more product in the box that was kind of like way underneath. All right, so that was what, $16? And we have the Fenty Beauty Highlighter for $36. The Milk Makeup Mask for $26. That's actually not a bad price. I would buy that if it works um in the future so we have the pure uh complexion authority brush set for 49 dollars 
the here's what this is exactly what I'm talking about the 111 skin rose brightening uh, face mask a hundred and thirty five dollars I would never buy that I would never ever buy that <laughs> it better do everything it says that's all I gotta say because that's like what it's just crazy. So we got the Ahava hand cream for $36. So uh, this box comes out to $373. I still think it is incredibly worth it. We got some really good products this month. I love pretty much everything in here. So we got the, the brush set, the eyeshadow palette, the highlighters, the, um, the face mask. Like it, this is a really good box. I am so happy. I am so happy. Even with the, the overly priced face mask, $135 uh, still very happy so that's it for both boxes or bags or whatever that's that's it for everything I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please give me a big old thumbs up I'm so excited because it's almost October that makes me very 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 happy because not only is it my birthday but I can start giving you guys my Halloween tutorials um, and uh, yeah Make sure you guys subscribe so you guys know when all those videos go live and I will see you next time. Bye.